everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jen. I do lots and lots of subscription box unboxings, so make sure you click on that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on anything. And if you're one of my current subscribers, I have now reached the 170 subscriber milestone. So thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who subscribes. I so very much appreciate you. In today's video, I'm really excited. I am going to be doing an unboxing of the November 2020 Sweet Reads box. The Sweet Reads box is now officially my number one all-time favorite subscription box. I got my first Sweet Reads box last month, so make sure you check out that unboxing video. And they are a monthly Canadian subscription box, and every single month they send you a New York Times best-selling fictional novel, plus some gifts that are kind of centered around the theme of the book, plus a snack, plus a drink. There is so much goodness packed away in this box. I just finished reading the novel that I got in last month's box. It literally only took me about four days because it was so adorable that I became obsessed with it. You know when you become obsessed with books and you're thinking about them even when you're working and all you want to do is read it? That's kind of how I felt about this one. So if you want to go to your local library and sign it out or I even buy it, I think it would be worth it. It was called The Brilliant Life of Eudora Honeyset and it is just adorable. So I will make sure to put all of the information in the description below as to how you can get your own Sweet Reads box. And of course, it's Canadian, so I don't need to add in the exchange rate or anything like that, but I will put in the total cost so that you'll know. All right, let's open it up and see what fabulous things they gave me this month. I'm so excited. Okay. Oh, we've got a little French here. So my French is terrible. If you're French and you're watching this video, feel free to make fun of me. It says, je me souviens. I hope I said that right. I probably butchered it. This is the front. And then on the back, it just tells you everything that's in the box. All right, and this is just a little bit about, um, about the book. And I think it's actually on the back, there's like a little description from the author. I'm excited already. Look at this hat. So this is from Little Blue House Heritage. How Canadian is this? Isn't this awesome? Oh my God, I love that. I'm gonna wear it for the rest of the video. I love this, it fits perfectly. Oh, I would have been happy if I just got this fabulous hat. Oh, I, it's heavy. Look, it's got a little llama, a little llama or an alpaca. It's covered in bubble wrap. I think it's probably breakable. Let's see. This is so cute. Look at this. It's really heavy. I'm trying so hard not to, to drop the lid. Let's see. Oh my goodness. This is just adorable. It's a little box, a little ceramic box. I love this. I can keep jewelry in it. What do we have next? We have lip balm, sweet almond. Inspired by all the gifts of nature. Wow, this is the fanciest packaging for lip balm I've ever experienced. So cute. Lip balm sweet almond, look at this. Smell it. Mmm, that is amazing. So it's more of a, uh, I'll try some out here. It's more of like a gel. 
Am I the only person who tastes lip balm? I always wanted to taste as good as, good as it smells. It smells amazing. And then it glides right on. I like that. What do we have next? Oh, dark chocolate with honeycomb. Are you now realizing why this has become my favorite box? It is like, it's just fabulous. What is this? Canada A. It's a Swedish sponge cloth. How cute is that? It's re it's reusable, washable, compostable, and one of these equals 40 rolls of paper towel. I'm looking at myself in the camera and I'm like, how Canadian am I looking right now with my hat and my sponge cloth that has all of these fabulous Canadian things on it. <laughs> I love it. Next we have Genuine Tea Masala Chai. Oh, the tea that I got in last month's box was by far the best herbal tea I have ever had. I can't remember, I think maybe it was hibiscus and elderberry or elderflower. So I'm looking forward to testing this one out. And of course, the star of the Sweet Reads box. This book is The Forgotten Daughter, a novel. Author of The Home for Unwanted Girls, Joanna Goodman. I can't wait to read it. I loved the other book so much that I am sure I'm going to love this one just as much. And there you have the November 2020 Sweet Reads box. I hope you enjoyed my video. If so, don't forget to like and subscribe and click that bell so you get notifications of all of my new posts. I hope you have an amazing day.